Hello, and welcome to a video presentation on the coordinate plane. Here's what you'll learn. How to plot and identify ordered pairs on a coordinate plane. First of all, what is the coordinate plane? Well, it's a two-dimensional grid comprised of a horizontal number line called the x-axis and a vertical number line called the y-axis. The point where the two axes cross is called the origin. Numbers to the right of the origin on the x-axis and above the origin on the y-axis are positive numbers. Numbers to the left of the origin on the x-axis and below the origin on the y-axis are negative numbers. The number lines break our grid into four sections or quadrants. The first one is labeled in the upper right hand corner as quadrant 1 and we label them counterclockwise around the grid. So this is quadrant 2, quadrant 3, and quadrant 4. Let's identify the quadrant that contains each point. Take a look for the red dot on your screen. What quadrant is that point located in? That's quadrant 4. Let's try another one. How about this point? What quadrant is that point located in? It's quadrant 2. And let's do one more. What quadrant is this point located in? Ah, I tried to throw you a curveball there. It's not actually in a quadrant, but it is between two quadrants. Do you remember which two quadrants it's between? That point is located between quadrants 1 and 4. You can identify, locate, and plot points on the coordinate plane by using ordered pairs. An ordered pair is a set of two numbers, one indicating how much we move left or right, and the other indicating how much you move up or down. An ordered pair looks like this. Two numbers separated by a comma inside a pair of parentheses. The first number is called the x-coordinate. It tells us how many places to move left or right on the x-axis. A positive number means we move to the right, a negative number means we move to the left. The second number is called the y-coordinate. It tells us how many places to move up or down on the y-axis. A positive number means we move up on the grid. A negative number means we move down on the grid. So let's go ahead and plot this point, 4, 2. All plotting starts at the origin, and since the origin is the beginning, its ordered pair is 0, 0. So let's start at 0, 0 by placing a point there. The first number, 4, tells us we're going to move four places in the positive direction or to the right. So let's do that. 1, 2, 3, 4. The second number, 2, tells us we're going to move two places in the positive direction on the y-axis, or up the grid. 1, 2. Our point is now at 4, 2. Let's plot this point, negative 5, negative 4. We always start at the origin, 0, 0, so place a dot there. The first number, negative 5, tells us we are going to move five places in the negative direction, or to the left. So let's do that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. The second number, negative 4, tells us we're going to move four places in the negative direction, or down the y-axis. 1, 2, 3, 4. And that's our point, negative 5, negative 4. Let's plot this point, 0, 3. Again, we always start at the origin, 0, 0. And the first number, 0, tells us we're not going to make any left or right movement, so we don't move our dot at all. The second number, 3, tells us we're going to move three places in the positive direction, or up the grid. 
one, two, three, and there's our point zero three. Now let's identify points on the coordinate plane. What are the coordinates of point A on our grid? We always start at the origin, zero, zero. And we move left or right first until we line up with our point. Here we're going to move to the right in the positive x direction, one, two, three, four places. So the x coordinate is going to be four. Now we move down in the negative y direction. One, two, three, four, five, six. So the y coordinate is negative six. And that's the coordinates for our point A. A is four, negative six. What are the coordinates of point B? Again, let's start at the origin, zero, zero and move left or right first to line up with our point. Here we're going to move to the left in the negative x direction, one place. So the x coordinate is negative one. Now we're going to move up in the positive y direction, one, two, three places. So the y coordinate is three. So point B is negative one, three. Finally, what are the coordinates of point C? We always start at the origin, zero, zero, and move left or right first to line up with our point. Here we're going to move to the left in the negative x direction, one, two, three, four places. So the x coordinate is negative four. Now, we're already at our point, so we don't need to move up or down. That means our y coordinate is zero. So point C is located at negative four, zero. Congratulations, you've learned how to plot and identify ordered pairs on a coordinate plane.